And now to River State, where the governor, Nisam Wiki, says government has identified hideout, safe houses and secret places which provide cover for hoodlums to plan and perpetrate their act. Governor Wiki made this known during a broadcast at the government house in Port Hackett. He ordered the demolition of some structures and shanties along Elele to a harder access of the east-west road, as well as illegal shops and mechanic shades along Eleme to a next stretch of the ever busy road to deny criminals the opportunity to continue to undermine the security of the state. I hear about the red owners of such shanties and illegal structures along the Eleme only axis of the east-west road to vacate the area within two weeks from today, 11 2021, our state government will go ahead to destroy these structures without any further notice. We understand the economic effects these additional measures have or may have had on some of our people and other residents carrying out businesses in the affected areas. But the truth is that we are simply discharging our constitutional responsibility. We can express the desire of his administration to continue to wage the war against insecurity and assured residents that the existing curfew will not last one day beyond necessary. He also directed officials of the Waste Management Authority to clear wastes across the state within one week or be disbanded without further notice. But we shall not give in to any sort of pressure. And the security of lives and property is more important for us to safeguard at all costs than the business or social interests of anyone else or group. The management of the state's waste management authority is hereby directed to clear the state of fitness within one week from today or be disbanded without any further notice. While appealing to residents to endure the temporary inconveniences caused by the curfew in the interest of the state and the collective well-being of the citizens, the governor said he has received report about the excesses of the state tax force on illegal trading in parks, especially the alleged shooting of motorists, extortions and abuse of the human rights of citizens. He assured that the government will not hesitate to bring the full weight of the law on any member of the tax force who crosses the boundaries. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.